morning everybody welcome back to my channel oh, welcome to the new subscribers it's lovely to have you here before we start i just want to i've put this on my map because a lot of people message me asking me where they can buy the products i've made or what else i do well i do a lot of um novelty things which i sell on upcycle crafts so if you want to pop over there you can even give me a thumbs up over there if you like. And I'm always, 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 always after a thumbs up on here. So I would be truly grateful. Right, let's crack on. If you watched my video um, two days ago, where my grandson jumped in on it, um, we did Noof, or Noof. And poor Noof was shut outside while the mouse was inside. So he was a bit fed up, which he would be. So he wanted to get his arm back. So here we go. Right. This was Noof trapped outside. And we just cut the um, windows out. I did have the measurements. But they're actually on the last video. I don't know if I've got them written down here. No. Um, so if you look back at the last video, you'll see the measurements for um, windows. So that was the card we made with Noof outside. So today he's gonna to get his own back. So if you watched it, I um I stamped the cat and then I clear eating boss it's just my preference before I colour in. So I've done that again. So it would have looked like that. But I've done him on bigger card and I've put an arm in his tummy. So I'm not gonna colour in but I am just gonna show you Roughly how it's done, but I'm not going to colour in because you can watch it on my last video. Green eyes. And that's with G14 of your Copix. Then we used W1. And like I said, it was the easiest colouring. We're just flicking in onto W3. Flicking in. W5. It's simply all we're doing and a bit of orange for the ginger cat. And that, that's literally all you're going to do. And it's so easy. And that's what gives you that. Like I say, I'm not going to do it on camera because I did it two days ago. So you can you can always look back. So that gives us this. New for already coloured in. So... I wanted to put something behind his tummy, so if you're looking all your um, your cut-offs, your backgrounds that you've done and not used, just anything. So this is a gel press one that I was playing with, just to have a go, and it didn't work the way I wanted it to. So I'm going to use this, and what I want is it's going to go behind his tummy, and I want those little bits to be around the bottom. So I'm literally... I'm just going to mark with a pencil either side there and the top and bottom. There is no shape, no nothing. I'm just, I'm putting further back than the lines obviously so you can't see it. There we go and I will save them bits because they always come in under. So I'm just going to leave that there a minute. Then on the back of Noof, piece of acetate, piece of packaging, anything. You don't have to buy acetate. This is just, and, and, and you can see I've been using it for um, blending off the end of. So I just, I use whatever's there, literally. So for me to clean my acetate, to stop it being sticky, I just go over it with wipes. Good job, you see the colour coming off. Over it with wipes, both sides. And I do have a towel. And just gonna just gonna dry over it. That's it. It it stops. You'd be surprised how much static it stops. And if you haven't worked it out, we are going to make a shaker card. So, I really, just, I'm going a bit bigger than 
got the back that we're putting on and it's just going to go over the hole on the back of the note. So we'll stick that on first. I use some red tape purely so I can see it myself. You know, when, when you get to my age, you struggle a bit with them dear old eyes. Well, I just went to opticians and they told me my eyes are six years on than what I actually am, so cheers. Nice optician lady. Right, I'm just going to take that off, the backing sorry, peel the backing off on the floor so that your robot vac can vac it up. Best thing I ever bought for craft room. I actually use it in the bedroom next door as well so I don't have to be it. I'm really sorry about that noise. My dog has come upstairs and she's snoring and it's like she's telling me to shut up. She's very rude. Right, I'm just sticking that down. Like I said, no, no shape to it. Just literally cut a piece of acetate. I've got a mark on that piece, but it's, it's fine. So you can still see it through there. Um, the next bit we're going to do, I'm actually, before we put the backing on him, I'm going to blend down the edges. This will all make sense, I promise. So with the green brush, um, it's a Lavinia Stamps number seven. This has quickly become my favorite green as this. This is um, green sleeves and it's new to me. So I've been using it quite a lot. So just as I normally would, I think you'll notice I like all my car cards. I like them to sort of have um, a frame, if you like. And this frames them, to me anyway. Nothing special. Start off the paper if you're new to blending. I literally coloured a new thing before I came online and it didn't even take five minutes. That's how quick it is to do it that way. I mean, you could go into more detail and um, do lots more. I've seen him coloured in absolutely beautifully, but I needed it to be quick and simple. You know, sit down and start colouring. Oh, well, I can be there for days, but I just get so into it. Not on one item, obviously. Right. That one will do for now. We're then going to put in pine. Again, it's elements. Look at all the glitter on my um, pad. Actually, there's no glitter on this today. That's unusual for me. As always, we're but same as what we did with the green sleeves, just not going out as far. Each time you drop a bit further back. Oh, I am so sorry about my dog. Little Lexi likes to be heard. Lexi! Lexi! Everybody can hear you. Hi! Everybody's listening. Uh, she stopped for a minute, but it, two seconds and she'll be back at it. <laughs> should be able to put some music on the background, shouldn't I? But I'm not sure how that works. All to do with having the vibes. To find somebody who makes their own music, won't I? I 
I know a lot of people felt sorry for Noof the other day when they saw him. I think they'll be all right now when they see this. I have practiced it so that it wouldn't take as long, so that I'm not keeping everybody. Drop me a message if there's out that you, you want to see me do or you've got some ideas that we can do with him or any of the other things that we do. Lexi, oh, I'm so sorry. Right, we're going to go on to the last colour. And that's Bermuda Elements again. Oh my, there's glitter on this one as well. Anybody would think I like glitter, wouldn't they? I've just been on um, to my YouTube before I came on to do this card. I can't believe you guys, how, how much support you've all given me. And I'm, I can't, I can't get it in my head. Little old me from Yorkshire and people are wanting to watch me and it's, it's mind blowing. I get the most beautiful comments. I get lots of private messages. Especially asking me if they can buy the item that I've made. So, hence this. It just says me repeating it. I do, I, well, I did last time. I put a link in for my shop on there. And I don't mind where I'm shipping to. It's, if you're willing to wait. Obviously, things take longer to other places. And I, I don't know what's going on, but something's going on with Royal Mail, isn't it? Not shipping abroad. I don't know what's happening there. It's only last year that I finished 18 years of working for Royal Mail. Never look back. Right, I'm going to clean my brush off. See, it's taken longer to do the background than it has to, than it did to actually colour him in to start off with. I'm just going to put a little bit more around of the lighter colour seem to have got carried away a bit. There we go. All good. Love it. There we go. All good. Of the rubbish. Right, I'm just going to put him to the side a minute and we're going to work on this little square. I did have it ready. Right, and what we're going to do is we're going to use the same mouse from the previous card, which is one of the woodland mice from Lavinia. We're going to stamp him up in Nocturne as normal. Stamp him off first, make sure he's working here. That's perfect. And we're just going to stamp him anywhere in the middle there. Just going to hold him down for a minute, make sure that he takes. I think that should be enough. There he is. Right. These, were you going to use um, some, oh my goodness, I can't remember what we call them. Um, phone pads. Wow. So when I use my phone pads to because I want to put it around where, where them little pencil marks are. Well, I'm going to put it just outside there. You can't bend it. But you take the release paper off both sides. You're starting outside the them lines. It doesn't have to be a perfect circle either because you're not going to see it. But by taking the release paper off. It becomes bendable. 
a lot easier. A lot easier to manage. Like I say, it doesn't have to be perfect. As long as um, one end reaches the other. This is a little bit I had left from the practice one yesterday. Make sure that's all come off yet. So, rejoin it. I hope you can see what I'm doing there. Didn't check. Just stick to your fingers a bit, but honestly, it's worth it. So much easier to use. Otherwise, you're going to be cutting it out in little bits and save that. I save everything. I think, I can't remember where these pads are from. Oh, there you go. These are the waffle flower um, foam strips. They're absolutely brilliant. I love it when they're already cooked for you. Right. Just because we're going to put some things in the middle, they, um, they'll stick to the side, cause obviously because it's sticky. So literally just with the anti-static, you don't want to touch the top because it'll stop the top sticking. You're just going around the edge, just like that to stop it sticking. Make sure that stays in a circle. There you go. Stops it sticking. That's all you need to do. Right, I've got some little stars because it's living you and it's all magical. These are itty bitty stars, Rainbow Delight. And I'm just going to put, my grandson asked me if these were blood cells. <laughs> He's got a great imagination. So you put in whatever you want to put in, but these are what I liked the other day when I did it. So I'm just going to do it like that. We've got the acetate on the back, so you work out where you want your mouse to be. I want my mouse to be about there, so I'm going to shake them out. I want you to be able to see him. So stick it down. I made the mistake of shaking it straight away. And everything came out. So it doesn't matter what it looks like on the back. There you go. And there's your mouse. Inside Noob's tummy. He got his own back. <laughs> so we're going to pad the back up. Obviously you have to have it padded up because you've got the little pad in there. This is scotch tape that I'm using. This is really hard to get hold of in UK unless you want to pay through the nose for it. But it's the best stuff to use all the way around right. I want to make sure that that's I'm going to put a little bit there just in case goes in the envelope and gets squashed you don't want it to squash in that little bit do you oh, there we go all done this is card base so we're going to take the release paper off nice and easy see once you've coloured them in this is probably one of the quickest cards you can make like I say, you don't have to use acetate, just use an old background for your, your bit that your mouse is on. It's it just so simple. Use packaging, I use all my packaging. It just so happens I had that piece of acetate hanging about. Take that off there. So, I'm going to stick him to the base. Hopefully I can get it right first time. This is one of my worst things. Looks pretty good to me. And there you have it. If you want to put some on inside, I don't know what you'd put. Um, cat got the cream, he did. So there you go guys. So 
we've gone from Noof being locked outside to Noof catching the mouse. And he's now in his dummy. There you go. I hope you enjoy. I hope you have a go. Give me a thumbs up if there's out that you see that you like. And a nice subscribe. Please share, 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 share. And I'll see you on the next one. Happy crafting, everybody. Bye.